Hello and good day to everyone and I welcome you to the another episode on tips and workflow. In today's uh, session, I am going to discuss on the improvement on sync mark predictions that Autodesk Moleflow has done it in the version 2021. I hope you have got a chance to work upon or install the 2021 version. If not, probably this video will help you to understand the improvements that we have done in 2021 version. To start with, I have taken a four sample parts and as you can see over here, uh, these parts are having a variable thickness rips. To have a better understanding on thickness, I ran a, a dimensional in, in mesh tab, I ran a dimensional mesh diagnostics which enables me to uh, understand on the thickness of the each of the ribs. Prior to 2021 version, there was always been a challenge to address the sink marks onto the thicker sections. When I say thicker sections, particularly we were getting a sink marks exactly opposite of the rib, but in the thicker sections, probably we were missing on predicting the sink marks. And this gets applicable in case there is no rip. Uh, still with 2020 version, you will be able to predict the sync marks. So with that, I ran these analysis or these four parts with two setups. When I say two setups, one is with the default packing uh, profile and other one with the auto packing profile or automatic profile packing profile probably you would have got chance to look at my earlier video on to the automatic packing profile setup so with that we will get started and have a closer look on to those enhancements on the sync mark that we have done it so first we'll get started with the default packing and you will not see any like a change into the results so it remains as at the sync mark estimate but the major difference that you will observe now is that you will able to see the sync marks onto the thicker sections as well like in this case probably you will able to see the sync marks onto the thicker sections which were missing uh, up to the version 2021 uh, sorry 2019.05 now when you run the analysis with the default packing and uh, with the automatic packing, automatic packing always try to optimize the packing profile to the best of it so that it gives the minimum shrinkage value or volumetric shrinkage to it. So let's look at the sync park estimate for in the both the settings and with the auto packing, you can see that I'm getting a much lesser value as compared to the default one. Now there is further enhancements that we have done in looking at the or predicting the sync marks. One is that you can see as a legend, but to make it more, you know, understandable when you're presenting to your customer, if you go into the plot properties and the optional settings, uh, by default, you will see as a color map as a rainbow. You can change it to the traffic light. It's very much similar that to the advisor, the old school way of looking it. I like it because this is something like uh, a traffic light, like you go, uh, you stop, and and be cautioned to it. So I divided every of the my legend into the three parts, and that gives me a fair understanding, like. In this case, my sync marks are pretty much higher compared to the, the flat portion. So if you need to make your customer understand that where the sync marks are of higher intensity, probably this plot will be of great use to it. 
there are another way of looking of uh, sync mark uh, which i liked a lot in the again in the optional setting is look at the grayscale and i just divided that into the uh, three sections just like a traffic light but you can do it as like a 256 uh, colors and this gives an understanding like how my part would look like it just like taking an x-ray and looking at your part uh, the other way is that uh, I'll change it to 256 and that makes it much smoother and gives understanding like how the sync marks are looking I hope uh, this uh, video was insightful and gives a fair information on the improvements that we have done into the sync mark predictions so try it on both the part with the rip and without rip i hope uh, you'll able to get the sync marks predictions much better as compared to the earlier version thank you for